welcome back to the school of this lecture today i will see what is the product topology at first i will see some concept about cartesian product and product then i will see what is the mathematical definition of product topology how look like the basis of product topology how look like the sub basis of product topology this is the goal of today's lecture now let's see first concept about product topology or cartesian product at first i will say product of a set then i will see what is the mathematical definition of product topology some uh, now i will see some geometry between product of a set let x y be two topological space if a is subset of x then a cross y is subset of x cross y then if this is the set a then a cross y would be such type Sim similarly b is a subset of y then x cross b is a subset of x cross y consider this is x and this is y and if this is the set b this is the set b then this is y cross b sorry 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 this is x cross b this this region is x cross b region i hope my all viewers have understood if b subset of y and small b is a point in x then small b cross capital b always contain x cross y and it is represented by this type of straight line this is the small b cross b here product between the set with the point b so here product with the point between the set so this is only the straight line i hope my all viewers have understood also if a subset of y and small a is a point in y then a cross small a is containing in x cross y and it is represented by this type of straight line okay this is small a cross a i hope my all viewers have understood this is okay oh now i will come to actual mathematical definition of product topology what is the mathematical definition of product topology definition is let x and y be two topological space and script b is a cross b where a is open in x and b is open in y and this is the product topology script b is product topology where a is open in x and b is open in y and script b is denoted as a cross b the picture would be this is x and this is y consider this is the set a and this is the set b this is set a and this is set b and this is denoted as a cross b where a is a open set in x and b is a open set in y then script b is denoted as a cross b where a is open set in x and b is open set set in y and this is denoted as script b is product topology
Now I will see what is the basis of product topology and what is the sub basis of product topology. Product topology which is defined as x cross y where x and y be top different topological space. First I will see the basis of product topology x cross y. Basis of product topology is look like u cross v where u is open set in x and v is open set in y. This is the basis for x cross y. This is basis because first condition of basis is trivial. Every element of x cross y Every point of x cross y, the itself as a basis element containing the point. Now consider b1 equal to e1 cross b1 and b2 equal to u2 cross b2. B two open elements, two elements in script brain. Who is inters who is intersect is other. Then B1 intersection B2 equal to E1 cross B1 intersection U2 cross B2. And this is equal to E1 intersection U2 cross B1 intersection V2. Since u1 and u2 are open in x that means u1 intersection u2 is open in x similarly v1 intersection v2 is open in y that means b1 intersection b2 belongs to this script b that means for every element b1 intersection b2 there exists an element b3 B3 contain B1 intersection B, B2 and the picture would be such the picture would be such type this is the P1 B1 is E1 cross B1 and B2 is E2 cross B2 and this is the intersection B1 intersection B2 For each element B1 intersection B2, there exists one basis element B3. You consider arbitrary element from this intersection, there exists always one basis element B3 who is content B1 intersection B2. Because I have got B1 intersection B2 always member of basis. So for every element in B1 intersection B2, there exists an element B3 equal to B1 intersection B2 such that B3 contain this basis element contain B1 intersection B2. So, so the containing element in B1 intersection B2 is U cross B such that u is an open in x and v is open in y. Hence, beta is a basis for x cross y for the topology. So, the topology generated by beta is known as, this is known as product topology. I hope my all viewers have understood how look like the basis of product topology. Okay, well. Clip B equal to U cross B where U is open in X and B is open in Y. Then B is a basis of product X cross Y for the topology, product topology. Therefore, if X be a topological space and Y be another topological space, if beta is a script beta is a basis for the given topology X and script gamma is a basis for given topology Y, then script D which is actually equal to set containing B cross C where B be the member of script B and C be the member of script gamma. Then D form a basis for product topology X cross Y. 
I hope my all viewers have understood how look like the basis of the product topology x cross y. Beta be a basis for given topology x and script gamma is a basis for given topology y. Then the set containing the element b cross c where b belongs to script b and c belongs to script gamma. This set from a basis for product topology x cross y. That means this type of basis member always generate the product topology. By this type of basis member, we can always generate product topology. Standard topology on R2, as for example, it has a basis look like AB cross CD, where AB is a basis on R and CD is a basis also R. So the standard topology on R look like AB cross CD. I hope my all viewers have understood how look like the basis member. How look like the basis of product topology. If X be a topological space, Y be another topological space. If beta is a basis for given topology and gamma is a basis for given topology. Then script D equal to beta cross C where B belongs to script B and C belongs to script gamma. Then D form a basis for product topology X cross Y. If you take standard topology on R, then the product topology generated by X tau and Y tau. And this is called the standard topology on R2 and this is generated by AV cross CD. I hope my all viewers have understood and and the picture would be this this in uh, the topology in R2 generated by this region this is AB this is CD by this rectangular region any topological space R2 is generated the basis look like this in example now consider X tau with discrete topology and y tau with discrete topology we all of us know in discrete topology always generated by single element then x cross y is the given product topology and this topology is generated by x cross y where x in x and y in y this is the basis element of x cross y i hope my all viewers have understood how look like the basis of product topology by this type of example now i will discuss the sub basis element of product topology now i will discuss product topology in terms of sub basis for this i will discuss projection map First projection map by one from x cross y to x such that by one x comma y equal to x. Second projection map by two from x cross y to y such that by two x comma y equal to y. Here the map. pi 1 and pi 2 are called the projection of x cross y onto the first and second coordinate. Okay, here on to because for this here project every perpendicular project on this line for this line 
for every pre image always i will get one image so this is the on to projection but this is uh, projection mapping this not one word because for different point in x y always i will get same value so this is not one one but on to projection if u is an open set in x consider this is u consider consider u a, this is as a v if u is an open set in x then pi inverse u precisely the set u cross y which is open in x cross y this is the pi inverse u and pi inverse ab means actually those xy such that pi 1 xy belongs to this open set ab this is the pi 1 inverse ab similarly if v is open set in y if this is considered this is v then pi inverse v means x cross y which is also this is the pi inverse v this is means set of those xy such that pi 1 pi 2 xy belongs to cd this this trick and s which is sub basis this is actually collection of so sub basis in the product topology is pi inverse u where u is open in x union pi o to inverse b where b is open in y this type of collection is a sub basis for the product topology x cross y and we all of us know sub basis is actually the finite intersection union of finite intersection notice finite intersection would be such type this this rectangle would be finite intersection and union of such type of projection all projection at first finite intersection then union always this type of rectangle always generate whole r2 this type of rectangle would be basis which generate whole r2 so this is the sub basis for product topology in x cross y i hope my all viewers have understood because arbitrary union of finite intersection of elements of s is a basis because when pro all projection when uh, finite intersection of this projection would be this type of rectangle who is generic whole r2 i hope my all viewers have understood this is okay oh, my all viewers have clearly understood what is the geometry of product topology till now my all viewers will be understand in better way what is the product topology how look like the product topology how look like the basis element of product product topology and sub basis element of product topology okay see you soon stay safe and stay positive always in my next video video i will discuss what is the box topology and subspace topology okay